In this video, we're going to tell you six things you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy if you want them to be healthy, happy, and thrive. Rottweilers are some of the most gentle dogs out there. They're loving, loyal, they're beautiful, and when they're puppies, they are the cutest. But in this video, we're gonna tell you seven things that you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy. The first thing you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy is show affection at the wrong time. When your Rottweiler is doing something they shouldn't be doing, the last thing you wanna do is show affection. When you do this, you're reinforcing that bad behavior. So for example, if your dog is nipping at you, you want to directly stop that. But what people do is they'll pet their dog, say don't do this, and it's confusing, and you're only encouraging that behavior more when you pet them. So if they jump up on the couch, take them down immediately. Don't pet them. If they're up in your face, up in your space, don't pet them and reward them, but instead correct them. So right away with your Rottweiler puppy, correct the bad behavior versus showing affection when you don't mean to do this because your Rottweiler will pick up on that as good behavior and do it more when really you want them to do it less. The number two thing you should never do with your Rottweiler puppy is allow them to nip. This is natural for a Rottweiler. They're a working, herding dog, and this is how they used to move cattle hundreds of years ago. So in order to stop this, you need to be calm, confident, don't lose your cool when they start nipping. It can be frustrating, but be clear and concise and make sure you stop the behavior immediately. And the best thing to do is exchange whatever they're biting at with a toy of theirs. So if they're biting at you, the human, or a piece of clothing, or shoes, or furniture, immediately exchange that with their toy. Biting is natural and it's okay, but it's not okay to bite another human, furniture, or clothes. So make sure you correct it immediately with firm direction that's not confusing and exchange it with a toy that should help. The number three thing you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy is avoid socialization. Rottweilers are incredibly gentle, loving dogs, but if they don't get socialized, just like any other dog, they can have real problems with other dogs, cats, kids, and people. But if you socialize this dog, take them everywhere with you, take them to the vet, car rides, in the store, then this dog will be incredible and you'll be able to avoid the negative connotation that comes with Rottweilers of being a mean, aggressive dog when that's not them at all. What that is is an unsocialized Rottweiler. Get your Rottweiler puppy socialized. If you do this, you'll have an excellent dog for a long time to come. The number four thing you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy is feed them exclusively kibble. We understand that kibble is affordable and convenient. But day after day, feeding your dog kibble can be harmful for them. Think of how processed it is. It's high in carbs and it lacks essential proteins that your dog needs. Instead, considering mixing in fresh food. There's a lot of different options out there and it can go a long way for the overall health of your Rottweiler. If you want to start incorporating fresh food to your dog's diet, we recommend We Feed Raw. There's a link in the description for a trial box. All you have to do is go on their website, fill out information about your dog, and they send you exactly what you need for your specific dog. It comes frozen, just thaw and serve, and your dog gets all the essential nutrients that they need. Once again, it's We Feed Raw. Link in the description. Number five thing you must never do with your Rottweiler puppy is avoid the vet. This accomplishes two things. It's important that your dog gets used to going to the vet because when you need to go to the vet, you don't want your dog scared or unsure or not liking a vet. And it's really important that you take your dog once a year for regular checkups. They can check for different things that Rottweilers are prone to. And if you do this, you can guarantee that you'll catch things early and be able to prevent problems with your Rottweiler puppy. But if you never go to the vet, it can be hard to take them and they don't want to go. And then you may miss things that could have been preventable in your Rottweiler. The next thing you should never do with your Rottweiler puppy is tie them up. This is confusing and frustrating for your Rottweiler puppy. Instead, they should always be with you by your side, but in cases that they need to be under control, you should leash them and still have them with you. This builds that bond and trust and ultimately the respect that you want from your Rottweiler puppy. But if you tie them up, leave them in the backyard or leave them in a room, this is frustrating, confusing, and it really won't gain the respect that you're looking for in your new dog. We hope you've enjoyed this video all about the Rottweiler puppy, and we'll see all of you on the next one.